If your toddler is starting to feed himself, you might need these. What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda. You might have a kid 12 months or older. And really, my kid wants to feed himself. And so he's always grabbing the silverware out of my hands. And so I picked this up because... One, these change colors. I didn't really care so much about that, but I wanted to find something that he could grab onto. So obviously a lot of the spoons that you will buy generally to feed infants are very long. You know, they're kind of give you standoff distance so that you don't get that yogurt or that baby food on yourself. These are much shorter. So that little hand doesn't have as much balancing to do, right? The hand can be right up here. You can see it's uh, not soft or rubberized, but it's a uh, hard plastic, should be easy to clean, but it's nice and thick. So it should be easy to grip for a big toddler hand. This is like a softer silicone, but it's not that soft, rubbery silicone. It's just kind of like a hard, bendable silicone. As you can see, it kind of moves quite a bit there. But we also get forks, and that's really what I wanted because there's a lot of things that he needs to stab, right? Little bread pieces, little pieces of hot dog, whatever it might be. And the spoon here isn't good for that. Even macaroni and cheese, where he could get it on the spoon, but he has a tendency to rotate his hand and the macaroni and cheese falls off. This allows him to stab those things. And the tines here are pretty dull, right? So he doesn't have to worry about jabbing himself or hurting himself. And again, pretty flexible here generally. But this gives him a little bit of that stabbing capability so you can get into that macaroni and cheese, the potato, the bread, rice, or whatever he's eating here. So. Again, what I like about that is that he can start feeding himself and get used to eating at his own pace, not have to wait or rely on adults to do it. And, you know, I don't have to worry about him hurting himself either. So let's see if he can feed himself with this and if my responsibilities to feed him are going to go down. All right, let's see how you do with your fork. Okay, giving the fork a try for the first time. Yeah, you got it. You got it, just like a big boy. Yeah, good job. Good job, good job. Yay, yay, good job, good job. So, if you want a oh, little safe plastic silicone forks for your toddler so that they can start feeding themselves and Learn to be self-sufficient. I'll put a link to these in the description below. Peter Von Panda and Theo, out.